He's into the box. Yo, Rumit's here, and today we're going to look at 86 rated fantasy foot Emre Chan. This card looks a bit crazy for an 86, so he stands 6 feet 1 inches tall. He has medium high work rates. His preferred foot is his right, and he's got 4 star weak foot and only 3 star skill moves. He's currently coming in at around 290k. I mean, it is an upgradable card, it already looks good. So I can see why he's that expensive. He may drop though. We'll see. He can play centre midfield, centre back or CDM. That is interesting. His club, Dortmund. He's got the Bundesliga links and the German links. I stuck a shadow on him, which makes him the lengthy accelerate type. So an artist, engine or finisher make him controlled. All other chem styles make him lengthy. Obviously, that's how it is at the moment without any upgrades. So his acceleration with the shadows boosted up to 80. That's a little low. Sprint speed up to 99 though. So the pace split is a bit off. We'll see how that impacts him in game. His shooting looks all right for a midfielder if you're going to play him there. Finishing 79, shot power 86, long shots 85. His passing looks good as well. 85 short passing, 85 long passing. The highlights, his dribbling, I mean agility 76, balance 79. We'll see how he moves in game. Reactions 87, ball control 84, dribbling 87 and composure 85. Defending looks great with the shadow. Interceptions 96, defensive awareness up to 87, standing tackle up to 96 and sliding tackle up to 99. He's got 94 heading accuracy with 96 jumping. Being 6 foot 1 he should win a lot of headers. Stamina 92, he'll last all of the game. Strength 90, aggression 91, very good stats there. Here's some information on the upgrade pattern of the card, obviously based on Dortmund's form. He's got the dives into tackles, leadership, flair, long shot taker and technical dribbler traits. I'm be playing him in the CDM position on balance and I might move him to centre back as well in the 4-2-3 on narrow in this team. But yeah, let's see how he plays. Good tackle there. Bit of weird movement. <laughs> Great play Emery Chan. Emery Chan in the box. I've red timed it. Ah, that was a great run. That was my fault. Oh, great interception. That's crazy. <laughs> oh, great play there, Emery Chan. I'm impressed with this card so far. Emery Chan in the box. Oh, referee. It's called a penalty. Blatant pen. Chan won it, so we're going to take it with him. Top right. <laughs> sends the keeper the wrong way. Oh, Chan stuck his long leg up there. Oh, got the shot away. Chan's got really good acceleration. Obviously, that's because he's lengthy. Lovely pass, Emery Chan. Good inception there. Oh, good leg out there. Good inception there. Ball through. Wow, what a pass. Ah, keeper's out. Unlucky. Emery Chan space in the box. He's lifted it too high. Good inception. Oh, long leg again. Driving forward. Oh, red time, tipped over. Did well to get there first. Driving forward and a great ball. Keepers out though. Oh, just got there first. Good tackle. It's a nice pass as well. Ah, I can't get a shot away. Well, one by Chan. Chan, into the box. Oh, I thought that was a goal for him. Unlucky. Good tackle there from the jump. Nice switch of play. Oh, what one back, Chan. Oh, I just can't get it to him. Yes, we can. Short, top left corner, Emery Chan. That's deserved, he's been brilliant. Look at that. Oh, just lost out. Get it back. Right place, right time again, Emery Chan. 
right place again. Nice pass. All through your legs. Finds the pass. Fouled as well. Oh, lovely pass, Morientes. Ah, he's moved the keeper. Good leg out there again. Important. Chan in the box just wide. That's a great pass. Bro, what did I do to you? Great acceleration and pass. He's into the box. Drills it home. Look at that from Emre Chan. Brilliant play. High five. Oh, brilliant strength. Oh, he's won it back. Lovely pass through near post. Red timed again. Oh, one interception. Ah, oh, he's got nicked off him, but no, oh, it was fouled. Great inception there. Oh, Emery Chan's in. Keepers out. Ah, it's off the ball. Maria Chan's <laughs> into the back of the net from close range. Good work from the both of them. Lovely pass out from the back. And we're on the attack. Ah, just offside. Unlucky. Good leg out in the centre back position. Did well there. Oh, did really well to recover there. I thought he was done for. Great tackle. Why is he there? He's, a, he's playing centre back. Bizarre. Good tackle there. Oh, lovely pass out from the back. Great interception. He's really good at interceptions. He just has really long legs. He's quite long in game. Good interception there. We're in trouble. So after nine games, we've got three goals, no assists. Not a bad return at all from the CDM and centre-back positions. And if you want to see more FIFA 23 player reviews on the latest players, please make sure that you're subscribed to the channel. But how good is he? He's very good. I'm quite surprised actually. Emery Chan's had some decent cards in previous FIFAs that I didn't feel lived up to the stats. But I do feel that this card lives up to the stats. I'm going to go through the pros. His pace, he's definitely fast enough with the shadow. He's lengthy. The only thing I will say about the pace is sometimes you do feel that he has slightly lower acceleration, especially off the ball. When he's on the ball, his acceleration is amazing because he's lengthy. However, when you're off the ball, I do feel like the acceleration, it just takes a bit for him to get to his top speed. But he definitely has enough pace. I do think I prefer him in the CDM position rather than the centre back position, but I do believe he can play both. His defending is on point. He always sticks his leg out to intercept the ball. He's a really long figure in game and yeah, it's really beneficial for your team defensively. Yeah, positioning, interceptions, tackling, all on point with Emre Chan. His physical is also immense. I mean, he's got 92 stamina, 90 strength, 91 aggression and it translates in game. He's brilliant physically. His shooting, I mean, for a centre mid, it's on point. If you get a chance in the box, I mean, three goals, nine games, that's not too bad, is it? I know one was a pen, but yeah, he's pretty good with his shots. Passing, although nothing amazing, it's definitely good enough. Dribbling, he is a little bit stiff sometimes. However, once you get used to him, he's pretty good on the ball, to be honest. I wouldn't be too concerned with his low agility and balance because I think him being lengthy does make up for that. And yeah, only con I can think of really is the skill moves. Three star skills, you'd want four star, but it is what it is. I'm giving him a 9.4 out of 10. He's about 320k at the moment. So... Yes, it is quite expensive for an 86 rated card. However, this card has potential to get a plus four. Add four to all of these stats. Looks crazy. Let's be more realistic and add a two or a three. 
still looks crazy. So yeah, I can see this card remaining relatively high because he's great in game already and can be upgraded. Looking forward to see if this card does be, get upgraded. Really impressed with it as it is right now. But again, that is only my opinion. Please like, subscribe and comment. If you appreciate this, take care.